My campaign is purely targeting young people. I'll continue working until the world know I only belongs to the elephants. Why, why should we be protecting these venomous snakes? I don't think there's any animal in history that is better prepared or better designed in nature to tackle you know, large numbers of, 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 of rodents than a population of venomous snakes. So if you were to remove them, you have too many rats and mice. We know that when you have too many, they certainly bring a lot of diseases. But most importantly, they will eat all our food. So I agree that a venomous snake in your house is not a good idea, but near it is a buffalo, or a lion, these animals deserve to be out in the, in the wild. We take all our snake calls seriously. The big part of what we do is we offer to come and remove snakes that are causing a problem, teach people about them, how you can live with them. They're always going to be there, so just work around it. But I think they're very, very important in, the, in, the, in ecology, for sure. So if you use these limited resources, to produce food that is then wasted. Basically, that points towards unsustainability. If we're emitting greenhouse gases, we are also, also contributing to climate change. In weekly basis, out of the 15 crates in the harvest area before, sasa zime rudi chini mpaka sita na mpaka tano. I remember mpaka soko ya juzi ni kwa ni metuwa kreti chatu. Out of the 15 crates, nine is in a potea every week. Na kitabo niru, ni malize kuchu na unakuta, takuwa ni mepoteza. Allowed that. Kenya is losing 500 million US dollars every year as a result of post harvest losses. Laikipia used to have one of the best populations of wild dogs in the whole of East Africa. And in fact, it had the sixth largest population of wild dogs in the whole world. In the past two years, the dog populations have gone down first really quickly. And where I was previously, we were having packs of 55 roaming across us, but not during the day. They had already decided we're not safe during the, the day. They came to me at night. We don't know the source of the virus. And that's what we're trying to work on, trying to figure out what happened. And of course, we have our own hypothesis on what could have happened all of that time. He, here is a record of the dogs that we were following before all the dogs died. These are at least 10 packs that we had. But all these packs died as a result of that outbreak. So apart from this single pack we had. It's very worrying, but I believe if you can put up efforts with people, uh, our media and conservationists, scientists working all together to spread the word and uh, to put money into conservation, to follow the dogs, find where the dogs are, then we'll have some hope. What we are we also getting is uh, we have uh, a bit more fish around seagrass that are near coral reef, which is important. That means the systems are connected. If we have a healthy coral reef, then uh, the seagrass around will be healthy as well as the other way around. Yeah. Okay, good. <sighs> Ngoje, ima, fumpi nye toto tufusediani. Most of the locals will believe that when they take turtle meat, they will be free from diseases. Uh, their kids won't get uh, sick. And some of them still believe when they eat turtle meat, they become strong in bed. Addition, <laughs> orange. <laughs> <laughs> Kwa fano zile tukataka sikingi wako bahari, 
kasa ni zaku, kwa hana kama nchakula, kama leather bag. Hakiwa na hile plastic, ama paper bag, kwenye maji, na wanambua leather bag, anakula jellyfish. Kwa hivaki wana kama ina, ina flow flow vile, hati wana kama ni, kama ni jellyfish, hata kula. Hati kula hezi kuisaga, kwa hivyo neza kumpatia nini madari. Tule tulione hiyo wanyama tukua tunataka tu kuwa. Katuambia, musiwae kuwa hiyo wanyama tena. Hiyo wanyama wataletea nini nini faida. Abat from wildlife, agriculture is the backbone of every country. Also wildlife here, it is a gift that has been given by God. Mostly, let them empower the community. Sustainable conservation without community cannot succeed.